everybody, this is Carlos Aponte Jr. with this week's Make It Happen video newsletter. If you haven't subscribed to our newsletter, what are you waiting for? It's absolutely free and it's going to help you. Just visit carlosapontejr.com. Today I want to talk about sharing stories. If you share stories, you will literally watch your MLM business grow. That's right. You will watch your business grow grow. I was reading a great article in this month's issue of Networking Times by good friend and a great trainer, Mr. Art Jonak, and it's it's all about telling stories. The easiest way to grab your prospects' attention is to tell a story. Art went on to, to write this. Have you ever talked to a prospect and sensed that they were bored or worse yet, not even listening? Frustrating, isn't it? My experience is, if you want to capture your prospect's attention, you'll need to tell a story. Most stories instantly grab people's interest. Maybe it has to do with how we are wired, or the soap opera genie within us, or the fact that humans have an intense—I'm sorry—an intense interest in what happens to others. Hence, the external fascination with gossip. I don't know why it is, but stories stop most prospects in their tracks. And here's a, a quote. If I were to if I were able to sponsor only one type of person into my network marketing business, I'll find the best storyteller in town. Just a few good storytellers later, you could be driving a viper like he does. And and he's just awesome. And that's what it's all about. I mean, if all you did was tell stories and teach your team how to tell stories, your business will explode. It is that simple. Facts tell and stories sell. It's all about my story marketing right now. If you take a look at the TV, the I like to call the the, the TV, the tube, you'll be surprised at how many reality shows there are. And why is that? Because everybody wants to know what's going on in people's lives. They want to see the real you. They want to know what's really happening. So it's all about reality TV. And if you want to grow your network marketing business, you have to start telling stories and sharing stories and teaching your team how to do the same. It's all about my story marketing right now. Here are some great ways of exposing great stories. So this is just a few methods that you can use to expose stories about your product, about your service, about you, about your business, about your successes. You can do that face to face. You can do it over the internet. There are so many websites online right now, Web 2.0 sites, where you can share your story, magnetic sponsoring, MySpace, YouTube, Made a Cafe, the list goes on and on and on. If you want a list of Web 2.0 sites where you can share your stories and stories of others, just shoot me over an email at ceo at carlosapontejr.com and I'll send you my top list of sites where you could expose your story over the internet. You could expose your story over the phone through three-way calls, when you're talking to a prospect on the telephone, share your story. You could also do that through websites, through videos like this video, or through YouTube, through webinars. If you're not using webinars, oh my God, you can build a tremendous business in the comfort of your home all around the world by using webinars. Very inexpensive. You can get a, a free trial of a great uh, webinar service, just go to Carlos Aponte Jr., click on resources, scroll down and uh, find webinars and just click on that and you'll be able to start prospecting and doing presentations and training your team through webinars. Another great way to share stories is through print media magazine advertisements. Awesome. We put full page ads out on most of the network marketing publications and you can do the same thing. So this is just some of the methods of exposing your story. Teach your team how to share stories and I will see you at the top. Become a great storyteller, recruit other great storytellers and teach your present downline how to share stories and do the same. This is Carlos Aponte Jr. Take care and I'll see you again next week.